a horror movie, but you know, what major actor hasn't started in a horror movie when they were starting out? Meetings were practical and there were always at least two or three people around in every meeting. I always felt secure and everything made sense until we went to see the set. They wanted me to become accustomed to the atmosphere. This is a decrepit old mansion on Seneca Boulevard off Highway 41. I just thought, I mean, you gotta see what you're shooting in, right? <laughs> I said it was a dress rehearsal of some kind. I drive to the gate, call the house, and a man answers the intercom. Leave your car there and walk the rest of the way up, he says. Walk the rest of the way up, I ask. Yes. Check out the scenery, take it all in. I'm like, okay, he wants me to get into character, right? It's night, which is a bit concerning, but while I was a little hesitant, reluctant, I'm thinking, all of this is just part of the process, go with it. I get up this fucking hill, <laughs> the driveway is actually on a hill, and I get to the door, I ring the bell, and wow, I didn't expect Mr. Kendrickson, the head of the studio, to answer the door, but there he was, tall, a bit unkempt in his dark suit. His tie was undone, draped around his collar. Didn't have a facial muscle move at all, one way or the other, and I smiled really politely. He just says, make yourself at home. And I laughed because I thought it was a joke. And again, his ambivalent demeanor on full display. He doesn't make nice to me. He walks out of the foyer and I close the door behind me. The light I'd seen was walking up the drive was coming from the foyer. The foyer's well lit. The rest of the house, completely dark. And where is everybody? The technicians, the director, the script supervisor, like people who run the set. I mean, I'm, I'm thinking that, but I don't dare ask. I look back at the door and when I turn back to him, he gestures this way with his hand, leads me into this massive living room and turns on one lamp light. A grand total of two lights on in the entire house now. At that moment, I'm thinking, I still hadn't met the director for crying out loud. I, I know some companies do their own thing, have their own set of protocols, but I don't know, I guess I didn't think I had to worry about that stuff until that night.